Okay, so here's an update on the van. This is probably uh, like day like five or six working on it. I don't know, I was gone Friday and Saturday. Today's Sunday and Joey's been working on it. So pretty much done with the dino seal. You can tell it's really not even sticky anymore. It's just turned out pretty good. And Joey's put a layer of the mat down. What's the mat called, Jay? The Noiko mat on the wheel hubs there, you can see both sides there. And then uh, start insulation. So he's already taken off the panel right here on this door um, behind that black thing and uh, did the, the dyno or the Noiko in there. And as you can tell, he foamed the door too. That foam coming out the door here. Wait, let me explain this. That looks great, huh? Um, one of the things that we did here was uh, we actually took these off obviously, and uh, ended up wrapping this in plastic. Um, but we ended up tucking wool up in here from the top, from the bottom, and then we ended up taking this part off and a couple other parts and tucking the wool down. And then I just, I put some foam insulation, but not very much. And I made sure I got rid of the excess here so it would blow out backwards, not towards the metal. So um, it should allow water to still run down um, as it's designed to. Um, and then on this side, I was actually, on the other side, I was actually able to uh, um, get away with not installing any uh, foam by tucking into these things individually. Wow, does that wear out your hands? But it helps significantly. And then we ended up doing the Noiko. That's what the Noiko looks like. And we hit almost every nook and cranny that we could fit the material in. Um, yeah, that's it. And we are using the um, Havelock wool insulation. I think it's from Oregon. We got one bag of the loose fill. You can see it's just all loose, so we can stuff that into areas that that it's easily stuffable. And then we also got two bags of the bats, which I'll show you over here. And we went with the R13 um, since it's uh, three and a half inches instead of the R19, which is like five inches. So. Yeah, have lock wool.